Lily was one of the great pioneers of the study of photography in Canada, and particularly Canadian photography. She, I remember her first coming to teach as a sessional at Carleton University, where I teach, and uh, being described to me before I'd ever met her by a close colleague as someone who was doing something entirely new. It's now become a major field in art history and a major area of uh, um, creativity and study, but she was one of the people who put that on the map. The other uh, huge contribution that I would want to point to is her vision in founding the Portrait Gallery of Canada. She uh, guided that process. She made sure that it received a lot of public um, uh, dissemination. She gave it a profile by putting a lot of things on the web, by creating all kinds of temporary exhibits all around Ottawa and across the country, which uh, helped people to, to imagine what this institution would be like. And in the days when uh, it was came under increasing attack as a project, she continued to uh, support it to extreme, in an extremely imaginative way, uh, help the public to see why we need this institution. And I can't imagine another person who would have done it as effectively as she has. I'm a specialist in Aboriginal art history, and Lily invited me to guest curate the uh, first sort of purpose, well, to guest curate the Aboriginal component of the portrait gallery. I'd never really thought about the subject of portraiture in another culture before. Certainly other people have worked on that, but for me it was something to think about freshly. And uh, because of the general framework that she and her staff had established, which was very open to alternative ways of thinking about portraiture, this gave me an opportunity to think about the um, way that that concept translates into a completely different cultural tradition, to consult with Aboriginal people across the country about how they wanted the subject of self-representation to be portrayed and, and presented to the Canadian public. And from that we learned an enormous amount. I think of her extraordinary enthusiasm, her intelligence, and perhaps more than ever considering the battles that she had to fight, her grit and her uh, persistence and her energy in not giving up on an idea that she believed in.